And this is where the identities were born. So we want to prove the sine of 4x is equal to 4 sine x cos x minus 8 times the sine to the third cosine x. So we start with the left hand side and we write that out, not that out. So we rewrite that argument as 2x and 2x because that's 4x. What's next? We're going to use the double angle. Yeah. So now we have 2 times the, let's expand both of those. Double angle. Yeah. Double angle. So now that we've done that, let's take care of that 2 in front. Let's just call that 4. All right. So now what? I think you're going to distribute. So go ahead. Distribute. There you go. To each one of those terms, making 4 sine x cos x minus 4 times 2 is 8. Sine times sine squared is sine to the third cosine x. All right, all right, the right-hand side. Box and all.